Let me show you how to customize your agent instructions. Follow me to my desktop right now. Welcome to job four. My name is George. And on this video, I'm going to show you how to customize your agent's instructions. You might have a super smart, straightforward AI agent, but maybe you want to give it more flexibility, more human touch to the AI agent. Well, that is possible by giving it instructions. So let me show you how. Okay, so this is my job form AI agent section. And if you are not here, go ahead and click up here and go into my agents. So now we're going to select the AI agent that we want to work with. In this case, I'm going to select this one, which is Miguel, a coffee consultant. Let's go ahead and edit this agent and it's going to take us to the builder section. So let's go into the training tab and in training tab, there's this option that says AI persona. This is where we're going to give it the instructions. So depending on your use case, you're going to instruct it on what you feel is the best method to give your AI agent. So in this case, what I want to show you is to change our AI agent from being dull and straightforward to being cool. So in this case, you can see the agent name, the agent role, the default language, the voice and the conversation style. These are instructions that are super important to guide it, how it's going to conduct its chat chattiness. So in this case, for example, your main goal is to gather coffee preferences. Okay. It, it even sounds like a robot robot when you're giving the instructions, engage users in a friendly and inviting manner, which is okay. Encourage sharing of experiences and insights about coffee, which is okay too. offer coffee grinders when interested. So too straightforward for me. Okay. So first off, let's get started with the name Miguel and too dull. We'll say it's Brewster. Why? Because this is a coffee business and we want to be cool. We want to know about coffee things. Okay. Next we have the agent role. So in this case, it's a coffee consultant, which even sounds dull for this type of business. Okay. So here we got some suggestions provided by job form. There's a beverage advisor, caffeine enthusiast and coffee connoisseur. So in this case, I'm going to use coffee enthusiast because we want enthusiasts to feel welcome and happy when chatting with Brewster in this case. Okay. Then chattiness, we have minimalist, short, long and chatty. So depending if it's too short, the phrases that it's writing, you want to make it longer. And if it's too long, you want to make it shorter. I'm going to keep it short in this case. Okay. Default language is fine. Tone of voice. You could use casual, professional, friendly, or type in your own custom voice. I'm going to leave it as friendly because I do want them to be friendly. Okay. And the conversation style, we can keep these or we can modify them to make them better. So let's start off by changing some of these. Let's start with the first one. Okay. I'm going to replace it with ask about their favorite brews, brewing methods, and coffee rituals. It sounds better, right? Okay. Let's change the next one. Keep the tone friendly, knowledgeable, and a bit playful. So we're giving it that little option to be playful. Okay. Let's change the next one. Invite users to share their best coffee moments, discoveries, and preferences. So we want to know about them. It's not just about selling. It's not just about providing support It's we want to know about you. We want to know what, what you like, what you would like to do. So good option there. Okay. And the next one I'm going to change is this one. If they show interest in elevating their coffee game, suggesting high quality grinders as a game changer. So that is giving them the instructions. We can add more to the conversational style or keep it as it is. Okay. So we've added four right here and it's just changed totally the way that the AI agent is going to interact. Okay. So let's go, okay, go ahead and click outside. This should be saved. Let's go ahead and test it out. So let's go into publish. Let's open in a new tab and we're going to start the chat. Here we go. And it should sound more enthusiastic. Okay. So here we go. It's an AI agent and you're a coffee enthusiast. What's your favorite brew? Okay. So I'm going to say my favorite brew B60 style. Okay. So we're letting them know here. It's a style of brewing. Do you have a favorite coffee bean or roast that you love to use with your V60? So if I continue here, you can see that it's more of a conversational style. It wants to know about us. It's just, it's not trying to sell. It's not trying to go right off and provide support, even though it has knowledge. So it gives us to coffee grinder manual, explore coffee grinder comparisons, learn about espresso brewing, etc. But no, since we gave it different instructions to behave in a different manner, it changed totally the way it's going to engage with your customers. So it's a fantastic way to provide a different instructions depending on your needs for your AI agent. And it's super easy to do so here with these settings in AI persona. So I hope you like this video. Please let us know here in the comments what you think about giving the instructions to the AI agent and what you would like to see in the future. 
don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that little bell notification to get notified when new videos come out. And that's a wrap.